Hi, I'm Taj Gibson, pro basketball player. I'm going to teach you the fundamentals of post play and the fundamentals I use to get myself ready during a regular season or any time I'm getting ready to play basketball. As time goes on, even in a long season or even in an off season, or even when I just want to play basketball, I always just think about how, which ways I can get better. During the off season, a lot of guys tend to just relax or play around, but every day I come to the gym and I go over my routine. To be a good post player, a lot of guys don't really understand what it takes. You have to have good fundamentals with footwork and strong fundamentals with understanding the game of basketball. As time went on, I really didn't understand the game of basketball and understanding the fundamentals of post play. But as time went on, I got better and better. And that just didn't come overnight. I always took time and I worked on my game and I worked on my footwork and I worked on my post moves. Right now, today, I'm going to have Justin come join me, and he's going to go over small things with me. Always, it's always good to have a good friend with you that can help you get, evaluate yourself and go over your post moves. Today, I'm going to go over my, my footwork, and I'm going to go over my routine that I use before games and even at home before uh, I even think about playing or touching the basketball. So but right now, I'm going to have Justin pass me the ball, and I'm going to go over my routine. My routine is, my first routine is going to be Catching the basketball, squaring my feet up, taking one dribble to the basket for a jump shot, for a, for a jump hook. That's my, that's my routine every game. I just, even though it may be simple, that's still gonna be my routine so I can have my good footwork down. Oh, the main thing is to always have good footwork and always stay low. A lot of guys tend to stand straight up. Me, I always try to just having good fundamentals and thinking about my routine. I'm always going to just work on just staying low, catching the ball, one dribble to the middle, right arm hook. Sometimes I may miss it, but after I go through my routine, I can make about 30 in a row, even sometimes even 50 in a row. It's all about getting better. So right now, I'm going to go over five jump, jump hooks. I'm going to throw it to myself. I'm going to catch it, take a dribble. That's one. Catch it again. Throw it to myself. Even if you're at home or you're by yourself, you can always do these things, these small drills by yourself. Just throwing to yourself, being strong. One, that's simple. And then at the same time, just because I'm a right-handed, over time I got better on my left hand because I worked on it. Using small, use strong fundamentals on the left-hand side of the basketball, on the basketball court, I was able to just use my left, taking my time and being even stronger. As right now, I'm gonna show you my left hand from the left hand side. I'm gonna catch it, throw it to myself, being strong, being strong with my butt out, being strong with good footwork. I'm gonna take one dribble to the middle. One, two. I may have missed a shot, but it's all about getting your left hand strong and being strong fundamentals. I'm gonna go with my routine. As you can see, in a time, I'm gonna make three in a row, from sometimes even get to five in a row. One, two. That's one. Always getting low. Same routine every time. One, two. At times you're gonna miss, you're gonna miss a couple of shots. You're gonna miss, you're gonna miss a couple of shots. But never get discouraged. Just keep always going after it. Keep playing, keep, don't, don't never get discouraged on yourself. A lot of guys tend to get discouraged on themselves and it affects their play. Always have fun with it and continue to get better. Next drill I'm gonna go over is, is, post, is post having good footwork. After so long I've been going over right jump hook, left jump hook, I made one of the try jump shot. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have Justin Throw me the ball, and I'm gonna, shoot, I'm gonna do a face up using good footwork, just turning, using my feet turning. Using my feet turning. Over time, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna get better. I'm gonna get, keep getting better from just using my footwork, keeping this right foot planted, and opening up to a jump shot. There you go. Well, first things first, always remember, if you're in a post and you want the basketball, you have to call for it. That's what I'm going to do first. I'm going to call for it. Ball. 
I'm gonna catch it. Good fundamentals, my feet are sound. I'm gonna open my foot up. I'm gonna open my left foot. Keep my right foot down. I'm gonna open up with my left. See how easy that was? Just doing it by myself and having fun with that. Over time, we, got, we must learn to have fun with the game. Never always take it so, never always take it as, I need to do this, I need to do this. Just have fun with it. And over time, you're gonna develop your body and develop your skills to a phenomenal player. As you can see right now, I'm just having fun right now. Just having fun, taking it easy. Squaring up, just being strong with the basketball, opening up, reverse, reverse pivot. I gotta make one now. Same fundamentals, reverse pivot. Same thing, fundamentals, reverse pivot. Always think, reverse pivot, keep it strong. Oh. Now I'm gonna have Justin walk with me to the left hand side and we're going over the same post, post moves with strong footwork. But at the same time, you gotta understand, I may, I may, you may get tired of me saying this to you. Always have fun. Always just go out there and just be loose. That's what, I'm, that's what some of the greatest coaches told me as I got, I got better and got to you know my game. As I'm gonna do, I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna reverse pivot using strong footwork. I'm gonna keep my left foot planted, open my right foot up. Mm. I begin confidence of just overly doing this drill so much. When the game time comes, you're just gonna flow right through it. Catch it. Open up. Jump shot. But one thing, the one thing you must always notice: every time I turn and open up, I'm facing the rim. I'm looking right dead at the rim. Justin's gonna throw me the ball. I'm gonna call for a ball. I'm gonna catch it. I'm, I'm solid. Footwork's good. I'm gonna open up. Reverse pivot. I'm gonna look, my, my chin, everything is in line. Everything is in line looking right at the basket. Even though I may miss it, I still, was on, I, was, I still had a good time, good, good shot target. I'm gonna keep doing it again. It's all about good fundamentals and keeping it going. Now as time goes on, I'm gonna keep challenging myself. Keep challenging myself. Make five in a row, 10 in a row, 17 in a row. And as time goes on, when the game time comes, you can be so fluent and having so much fun, you never gonna think about anything or anybody else trying to challenge your game or your shot. I'm Taj Gibson, that's my pro tips.